All right, so we're ready to head out. I've got my finest ROG merch on. I've got the tunes ready. I've got the Google Maps. It's going to be a pretty big old drive up to Overclockers, but that's okay because I know that they've got some really cool and interesting stuff they want to show me, some brand new PBA systems and something else that's a little bit uh, exclusive as well. Ooh, what a lovely day. Good job we're going inside. Cool, so I'm here with Jacob. Um, you're gonna show hey us around some of the cool stuff that we've got going on here. Some of the cool stuff down here at Overclockers. We're yeah. gonna have a little bit of a tour, check out some systems later on and have a fun time. Let's do it. I'll flip this camera around and then you guys can get a, a really nice tasty view of everything that we've got. Welcome to Overclockers. This is our shop. We've got everything you could need. Have a little bit of a sample for what you can get from our store. We've got the beautiful Asus section here. Some wonderful motherboards. Some of the more retro ones down here. Wonderful little Asus Lego that we got sent that took us way too long to build, but it's beautiful. Ah, oh, isn't it <laughs> worth it though? So worth, worth the time. it. So cute. Some some of the retro boards as well. Yeah, exactly. We like to keep it retro here, and uh, some of the newer ones above. So a little bit from the entire timeline. We've got the Rog Strix GPU range, new RTX cards. Oh, yeah. oh. oh. <laughs> locked away. The golden chalice. What's behind the door? This is the secret door. Staff only, no entry. But we're breaking all the rules today here for Asus. Come in. Everything going on here, testing zones, RMA, Tommy Wiseau. B4 RTX. Nice. All the testing systems. So what have you got going on here? So Building plus testing? Building plus testing, yeah. Um, everything's tested in-house. Everything's made sure that it's perfect, ready to go when you order. You can trust us. <laughs> This is where some of the special stuff goes on. Ooh. We've got, I believe, it's the 3D printer. It definitely does something cool. It does something cool. That's where we have custom oh. engraved glass oh, for, wow. for the uh, glass panels on our systems, which can look rather beautiful. We did um, a collaboration with Call of Duty not long ago, and we had the Call of Duty logo on there looking pretty nice. And uh, yeah, we can do some pretty cool stuff with it, and it does come out looking quite nice. Moving on out here. Take on through to the forbidden lands of the warehouse. Oh, wow. Here, but you might be able to hear. <laughs> Lots of GPU goodness. Ooh. Every game is dream. Let's see if we can find some Asus. I don't know where anything is, but let's find it. One spotted immediately. One there. Beautiful. <gasps> They're, They're everywhere. Here. They're everywhere. Asus is everywhere, <laughs> as it should be. <laughs> all right, so we've seen all the cool stuff. We've got the graphics cards and the motherboards. Yeah, That's all very well and good, but there's something more important than that, right? What could it be? You're overclockers. Haribo! Haribo with the Haribo. Ah, oh, beautiful. Every order. A cheeky one of these, so what more could you want? I'll be taking that. There you go, my friend. Yoink! Right, so that was the warehouse. We've had the full tour. Um, now we're going to go up to the marketing section. We're going to check out some of the fully built PBA systems, um, some of the cool Asus builds that they've got going on, and we'll see what other goodies they've got laid out for me as well. The mythical well, office legend. of the legend himself. We're going to be talking to him later, I believe. He's real. Uh, <laughs> so if you want to check out our stream area over here, yeah, where the official uh, overclocker stream yeah, takes place. Exactly. Ta-da! Wow. Uh, sort of command station here. Ooh. Twitch presenter. Stream presenter even, not necessarily. And then we've got some systems set up over here. Green screen. So you can get the whole squad involved whole squad. for one stream. Beautiful. So the final room, as I've been informed, is through here. So this is where all the, the studio-based magic happens. And it's pretty dark and spooky. <gasps> Ooh, but look at this. It's beautiful. Let me, I need to switch this round, I need to switch this round. Let's have a look. So we have right here, I do believe, two of the finest PBA systems going. Powered by Asus. This Lee and Lee case here looking absolutely beautiful. And of course, the overclockers casting couch in the background as well. <laughs> Doesn't matter if there's a little bit of noise. It's supposed to be, it's cool and casual vlog stuff. <laughs> Anything goes. All right, we've got everything set up. So Jacob, where is Jacob? Hey. Oh, there he is. Here. He's gonna take us through uh, exactly 
some of the cool stuff about some of these PBA systems. What makes them so special? Obviously you can see they're very shiny, but it's not all about shininess because there's some other cool stuff as well. So let's flip the camera around and we can do it. So we've got the Radiance Plus and the Radiance Pro, both in our PBA range, powered by Asus. This is sort of your more entry into the PBA range. By no means does that mean it's not a great and powerful system. It's just as it's above leaps and bounds above a lot of other machines still but if you want to take it that extra mile you can go up to the radiance pro which is really a stunning machine um it's mostly mostly all asus components and um, anything that isn't asus was hand-picked to complement asus yeah um, i noticed you've got the the t-force ram in there yeah syncing up very nicely it goes perfectly that's one of the main things we sort of were aiming for with the power basis range we want sort of amazing synergy between the the components we've got the asus components which obviously work brilliantly with each other but we've got sort of like the lian Li rod case we've got the team group ram and it all works so perfectly together aesthetically and performance wise what do you think makes overclockers and powered by asus the perfect combination well all of our parts are hand-picked by passionate and talented builders and um, you get three years warranty so you can be sure that if you have any issues they will be sorted out and um, you can use a uh, finance if you can't scrape together the pennies at the time and um, and yeah, that's uh, sort of what you get with overclockers and Asus. And yeah, that's certainly something that we saw earlier with all of those system builders um, working away and also testing everything as well. Yeah, we um, to make sure they're perfect and ready to go before they ship out. Yeah, and you can tell as well the attention to detail here is really, really nice. These aren't just a bunch of components put together in a machine, but all those finishing touches and those little bits that change your PC from decent looking to really great looking here as well. I also just noticed there's not only systems here, we've got a couple of the cool peripherals as well. So if you've not seen these specific ones before, this is not just your run of the mill uh, bog standard ROG Strix Flare and Gladius 2 Origin. This is actually the Call of Duty version. So uh, when Black Ops 4 came out a couple of months ago, you could also get your hands on a couple of these different COD branded peripherals, which are pretty cool and interesting. So the Flare keyboard, for example, you get this little cool COD branded insert and uh, with the mouse, there's a little COD logo on there as well. So yeah, it's one of those interesting little things that a lot of people might not know about, but it's just a fun little variation that we did. And uh, yeah, something you can pick up on clockers, in fact. I found this little window to the warehouse. So if you didn't have a, an idea of how big it was before, you certainly do now. And you can bet that there's some Acer stuff right down there somewhere. Come on, boys. Last boys, man! Man, that's boys! Last boys! Boys, man! <gasps> oh, it's here and it's real. The Orion X2. Here you go. Here you go. You feel it? It's the grand PC. <laughs> so we've got the system all set up and ready here. We've got APAC as well, so he's going to talk to us a little bit about everything that's gone into this crazy system here, the Orion X2, and what exactly makes it so special. So we'll flick over to the other camera and then we can do exactly that. All right, so we've seen the powered by Asus systems, and this one is a powered by Asus system too, but as you can see, pretty different to those other systems. So we've got APAC here. What exactly makes this so special and so different to everything else out there? Uh, hi, everyone. Uh, this system, uh, obviously, uh, from the look, you can see it's very, very different to anything else uh, that you've seen uh, so far on the video. But um, basically what the idea of this system is, is you have two, two systems within one chassis that are capable of 4K gaming and any other professional use that you would throw at the machine. So this is uh, a single unit that doesn't just do anything, but everything. Yeah, exactly that. It does, it does everything. Mm. Like you've got the high core count, slightly lower core speed uh, CPU with, with lots of raw graphics power, which can do any professional task as well as gaming. And we find that a lot of customers who are buying this system actually use the bottom system for home integration, you know, like controlling the lights, CCTV, uh, maybe have the music catalogue on the server there and then using like the Rune application or something like that to stream to high-end audio equipment or endless possibilities in the home and then they're using the top system for uh, a more professional approach and, and gaming. Thank you so much for your time. Yeah. Um, yeah. Pretty much everything you ever wanted to know about the Orion range. So if you want to pick yourself up an Orion X2 right now, you can do so on overclockers and there's a whole bunch of different 8-pack systems on there as well. So we're just on the way out now and I just happened to have spotted this rather nice Asus PC that's being set up there. Check that out, super cool. 
Right, well, that is it. Back to normality now. Back to the, uh, the standard showroom. We're out of the VIP section. And uh, that means, unfortunately, it is home time. But it doesn't mean that I can't grab some of these on the way out. And we're gonna head home. So uh, it's been a pretty sweet day checking out all of the Powered by Acer stuff. That eight pack system as well, absolutely awesome. But here we are at the door. So that is everything. We will see you next time in the next video as I head outside back into the rain. See you later.